Hello, this is my AI assignment. This is the menu screen, so see how to play. Use arrow keys to move and mouse to look around. Use left mouse button to shoot and right mouse button to throw a grenade. Collect all the coins to complete the level and shoot, bomb or make enemies fall for purple traps. Go back um, as you can see we have to collect these coins. Uh, Here is one kind of uh, an enemy uh, which follows waypoints. There are total five kinds of enemies and each level will be introducing uh, one kind of enemy or NPC. Uh, so let's play. Um, on the top left we have the health bar on the top right we have the items left I've tweaked the value I've kept it to 1 for this quick demo in the real game the value is 4 or 3 and, and varies from level to level we can use the left mouse button to shoot bullets there's a nice part of the effect going with it uh, and the audio of the bullet is 3d so you won't hear much when it explodes uh, further but you will hear it loud when it's near uh, you can use the left you can use sorry the right mouse button throw a grenade and as you can see the NPCs um, go transparent they fade as they as they lose their health so we can just get it and you can stay and dice um, by the way, these NPCs were using waypoints to move. Um, so, as the time is running out, uh, you can see the time in the middle. Uh, we'll just finish off this level. So, we we'll proceed to the next level. So, here in this level, we have these blue enemies uh, which follow, which use rakers. Um, and once we lose the enemy, they go back to their initial position and start rotating as you can see in the scene view uh, they're using raycast raycast to look for the player uh, we can kill them like this as well um, and in the in the bottom left you can see the number of lives you have so as they as they uh, shoot at you with bullets your health will decrease and once it's zero you'll just die so move on to the next level in this level we have these red enemies so they are basically doing the same thing but instead of just looking at the player uh, Looking at the uh, looking for the player inside, they will follow the player breadcrumbs. So I think this guy is a bit far. Um, we'll try. So now this one is to follow me and. He will go back to his position once he loses the breadcrumbs and we'll finish off the level as the time is running out. Um, so you can see the guy here, he goes back to his position if he loses the player uh, by following his own breadcrumbs. So we'll proceed to the next level. Uh, in this level we have this green guy again who uses Raycas. Uh, okay. um, and here we have these new kind of enemies, uh, purple ones. They are same as the red ones in the previous level, but they are a bit more intelligent. They can avoid traps. Uh, we'll see the traps in the next level. Um, they work same. They'll use the Rekas to look for the player, as you can see in the scene view. And once he sees the player, he will follow. And once he will lose the player, um, he will go back to his own path uh, or look for player's breakup. So now here we proceed to the next level. Here we have these black guys. Uh, they are the final enemies. 
they use Namesh to look for me and this purple light is the uh, trap so this guy should avoid the, those traps so once he finds me um, he couldn't find my breadcrumb so he went back to his path uh, but let's wait for him to look for me and Once he finds me, he will follow me and when he touches the trap, he'll just go back to his place and we'll finish off the video. And congratulations, you have defeated the enemies and escaped from the maze. Press main menu to go back to the, go back to the main menu and here you can start the game again thank you